And there's a deadly accident in Wellington. Let's begin with that fatal accident along Lake Worth Road and 120th Avenue. News Channel 5's Thalia Hayden is live at the scene. Good morning, Thalia. Do investigators know what happened yet? Yes, John, good morning to you. Let me show you what happened here. This Bentley was driving southbound down this road, drove through the stop sign you're seeing right there. Then a uh, Hyundai was coming down this way, and right at this intersection, both cars collided, forcing that Hyundai into the canal. You're seeing right there, deputies are working to get that Hyundai up and out of the canal. The scene you're seeing is right there, as you can see being loaded onto the tow truck right now. now. The driver of the Hyundai is confirmed dead. Deputies say the driver of the Bentley left the scene after the crash. They found him down the road. He is now at Wellington Regional Hospital. Investigators say just the two drivers were involved. No passengers in either car. Again, the driver of the Hyundai is confirmed dead. The driver of the Bentley is in the hospital. We do not know the degree of his injuries right now. We are told that family members of the driver of the Hyundai may have showed up and deputies are working right now to get grief counselors on hand here for them. We don't know the identity of either person at this time. I will continue to follow up with information and bring it to you as it comes along. Live in Wellington, Thalia Hayden, WPTV News Channel 5. In a deadly Wellington accident, the overnight crash involving a Hyundai and a Bentley sent the compact car careening into a canal, killing its driver. We've now learned that the driver of the Bentley was John B. Goodman, a prominent member of Wellington's polo community. He owns a sprawling ranch not far from the accident scene. News Channel 5's Thalia Hayden is live at the crash site. Thalia? The Hyundai is registered to William and Scott Wilson, father and son, 23-year-old son. Now, there was only one person in that car. We do not know who was driving the car. All we know is that, that it was registered in their name. This is what's left of the four-door Hyundai that was forced into a canal after colliding with a Bentley. As you can see, there is extensive damage to both cars. Any crash of what the damage is, if you have a fatality, it's a very bad crash. It happened around 2 this morning at the intersection of Lake Worth Road and 120th Avenue. Deputies say a Bentley plowed into the side of this Hyundai, causing it to sink into the canal. The driver of that car was killed. Although deputies have not released the victim's name, family members did show up around 5 in the morning to identify their loved one. In a day or two, they're going to have to deal with the medical examiner's office and, and start making funeral arrangements and things of that nature. As for the driver of the Bentley, John Goodman, he was taken to Wellington Medical Center. Deputies are looking into speeding and alcohol as possible factors in the crash. Now, deputies say Goodman left the scene of the accident. They actually found him down the road and then took him to the hospital. Now, I've been here since 3 in the morning speaking with people in the area about this accident. There's a coffee shop owner who says he knows Goodman very well, that he comes into his store all the time, and that he's a very nice man as far as charges against Goodman. Uh, deputies say it is too early to tell. They are still investigating. Live in Wellington, Thalia Hayden, WPTV, News Channel 5.